Jupiter's moon Io is the most volcanically active body in the solar system, so when astronomers from NASA's Juno mission say they've discovered a massive volcanic hotspot in the moon's southern hemisphere, you know it's going to be spectacular. The hotspot is estimated to cover 40,000 square kilometers, larger than Lake Superior on Earth, and it emits 80 trillion watts, or six times all the energy of the world's power plants. Io whips around Jupiter once every 42.5 hours, and its elliptical orbit means the gravitational pull from the massive gas giant squeezes Io, melting part of its interior and causing lava plumes and ash to vent from the surface in over 400 volcanoes. The latest hotspot has been discovered thanks to a close flyby of Io by Juno using its Jovian Infrared Aurora Mapper or Gyram instrument. Originally designed to peer through Jupiter's cloud layers, Gyram is now being used on Juno's extended mission to observe Jupiter's four largest moons, Io, Europa, Ganymede, and Callisto. The hotspot on Io was so intense that it actually saturated the detector on Gyram. In these visible light images from a separate instrument on Juno, comparing two previous flybys to the new pass, you can see significant changes to the surface of Io in the region of the hotspot. Juno will be back for another pass of Io in early March, and it'll be super interesting to see how this massive volcanic eruption has developed. That's our space short for today. I will see you back here tomorrow.